Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here though, my name is Hannah and I upload beauty videos on Mondays and Fridays. I would love it if you stuck around and subscribed. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out. I got my BoxyCharm here. If you wanna see what I got in my box, make sure you keep on watching. I would just like to point out that I got this box on Monday and I'm filming this on a Wednesday and I did not open it up until now. And I just, I just need to mention that. I thought about it, I thought about opening it up. But then I didn't. Ooh. Okay. First thing I see in here is um, shampoo and conditioner. I have heard of this brand, but I use Monet shampoo and conditioner, so I'm not going to use this personally. But that's the first thing that I see in here. Oh, also, I do have some makeup on. My skin isn't doing the best right now, which is kind of annoying, um, but I do have some makeup on. The next thing is from 111 Skin. Very excited about this. This is a pollution defense booster. This is what the box looks like. This retails for $135. This is what the bottle looks like. I'm very, very excited to use this. As I mentioned though, I do already have some makeup on, so I'm not going to use it right now, but I am excited that I got that in my box. The shampoo and conditioner retails for $24 in case you're curious. Next up is this from Hourglass. Is this the thing? Because this feels like it's empty. No, okay. I For a second, I 100% thought that this box is empty. Thankfully, it's not. This retails for $28. I love the packaging of this. It, I don't know, it's really pretty, I think. Um, let's see, it says warm blonde, so I do have blonde hair, but I do get highlights, but this actually looks like it might be a good shade for me. Let me use this and then we'll figure out, but I'm going to use the mirror from this Ace Beauty palette. Okay, this is really pretty packaging. Oh, okay, so this is like a contour palette. This is what it looks like right here. So I'm going to fill in my brows. Also, I think I'm going to use this for a very simple eye look as well. Um, just because, you know, I don't have any eyeshadow on. Since I'm going to do that, I'm going to go ahead and prime my eyes with the Smashbox Shadow Primer. Now I'm going to fill in my brows with this hourglass. Also, yet again, I feel like I mentioned it on so many of my videos, but I do still need to get my eyebrows waxed. I think that this is a good, yeah, I think that this is a good color match for my eyebrows. It's a very thin line as well. Very, very thin, I'm not. Maybe you can kind of see that. Just going to set those with the Benefit Gimme Brow. Also, while I have this palette out, I'm going to go ahead and um, contour my face. First, I'm going to just apply um, this Laura Geller powder. This wasn't from the box, I just already had that. Wait, the rip? We'll use this brush, sure. I'm going to use this Olimar brush, which I got in a, bo in a previous boxy charm to contour. And I'm going to, I think I'm going to use this shade. Very pigmented, but also I know that I did, like this obviously wasn't, you know, like a freshly cleaned brush. So there was, there might have been like previous product on here. But I think, I still think that this is fairly pigmented, so that's nice. Like that quality about it. I'm 
Yeah, this is very pigmented and definitely blends easily, I would say. Let me go ahead and do blush and highlight. This is a Tarte blush that I already had. Oh, for highlight in Star Island. Now I'm going to create a very simple eye look with this as well. Um, I think I'm going to use third shade here. It's kind of my um, transition crease shade. Yes, once again, very pigmented, I would say. Going to blend that. Also, this palette retails for $30. I just realized that I did not tell you that. I'm going to use this kind of small shader brush and apply that first color all over the lid. Apply this color all over the lid. And then the last thing that I got was this um, eyeliner which I do not wear eyeliner. Like I wear eyeliner very, very rarely, but I guess I will apply it and I'll let you know. But also since I don't wear eyeliner that much, um, I don't know, that kind of, I don't know. I don't wear eyeliner that much. It is like a marker, which to me, um, I kind of like the ones that are the wand that's a little bit more flexible, just especially like based on how I apply my eyeliner. It is really pigmented though. I will say that. Let me apply the rest of my makeup and I'll be right back. The products that I got was this 111 Skin Serum. I got this eyebrow pencil from Hourglass, shampoo and conditioner. I got this um, Bronzed in Paradise palette, and then I got the eyeliner. Personally, I'm probably least excited about the eyeliner just because I don't wear eyeliner that much. Um, but that's just a personal thing. I do like that this hourglass does, I feel like it's a very good shade match for me, but I'm most excited to try this 111 Skin um, Pollution Defense Booster because, I don't know, if you, if you watched my videos before, you know I love skincare, so I'm very, very excited about that, very excited to try those out. Once again, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really, really does help me out. Also, I would recommend watching this video right here. I'll just link it if you want to go ahead and watch another video of mine. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I would love it also if you stuck around and subscribed, and I will see you in my next video.